It's check-in time at the SmackDown Hotel. The following contest is an eight-man ladder match and is for the WCW Heavyweight Championship. Making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, The Rock. You can just feel the energy of the great one as he saunters down to the ring. Oh, he's the most electrifying man in sports entertainment, and he's taken WWE by storm. Uh, if you smell... Whoa, 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 whoa. This ain't sing along with The Rock, Saxton. I thought it was. Rattlesnake! And from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, Stone Cold Steve Austin! Watch your five hole, Saxton. Anybody see my ice pack? Austin, trademark scowl on his face. The biggest anti-hero in WWE history. Stone Cold Steve Austin says what he wants, does what he wants, and he's not afraid of the repercussions. The title collector is here. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar! Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. The double champ showing off all of his hardware. Arrogance and confidence on the double champ's face, but he's obviously earned it. The COO of WWE, but also a man who is absolutely dominant inside that ring. Something tells me we're about to see what's best for business. And from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, the game. We are moments away from a true exhibition of authority. In the ring, he commands respect. He's a technical mastermind. Triple H has seen it all. 
Triple H has done it all. And much like his nickname says, Triple H is always at the top of his game. The creator of the pedigree, a truly devastating move. Yeah, and he's mastered how, when, and where to utilize it. And yeah, the pedigree almost always guarantees the end for Triple H's opponent. I guarantee Triple H already has plans on when to use it tonight. It's Mr. Money in the Bank. And from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 270 pounds, Goldberg! Ladies and gentlemen, the title will be hanging high above the ring here tonight in what promises to be an incredible ladder match. And as we've seen in the past, the ladder will likely become more than just a set of steps used to reach the championship. There's a good chance we'll see it used as a weapon as well. opportunist. The title collector is here. And from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. The double champ showing off all of his hardware. Arrogance and confidence on the double champ's face, but he's obviously earned it. Make way for the double champ. And from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, The Undertaker! Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. 
Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. The double champ showing off all of his hardware. Arrogance and confidence on the double champ's face, but he's obviously earned it. when you're on the very top of the line. Big four. Nice arm drag takeover. Nice hit toss. And that was a vicious DDT we just saw. Bring out that ladder here in uncharted waters, ladies and gentlemen. Nice takedown.
This is it. He could do it right here. I don't know about you guys, but this looks like quite a gamble to take at this point in the match. Who's the goal? From the top. Oh, God. That, that, that's a bad landing. Was trying to make a big splash with that, but there was no water in the pool. Lesnar cuts him off.